Hey, this is Russ. I'm going to show you guys how I do chicken legs on a Weber grill. So let's go ahead and get started here. Alright, we got to put some charcoal in here. Okay, I'm going to start up the... Uh, start up the fire with this wax cube I put up uh, a bunch of uh, charcoal inside a chimney you can see it's blazing really good so I'm going to take this and we're just going to pour it in here Missed a couple there. Which could be a problem. I'm just going to move them out of the way. There we go. <laughs> this is the chicken that I plan to use. They're just chicken legs and they're on a rack system. So let me move it over. So we have a heat source on either side, on side baskets, and then all of the chickens, our chicken legs are on a rack. And what I'm gonna do is every 15 minutes or so, I'm gonna swap these things over. So both sides gets full, um, full heat. This is the easiest way to do chicken that I know of. And uh, you, you really don't do anything. You're just moving the rack, making sure that the chickens on both sides of the chicken gets uh, heated up. So check it every 15 minutes. And I'm just gonna adjust the top here. And on the bottom, just make sure that that is set for a decent airflow. Okay, it is time to reposition the chicken. So I'm gonna simply grab one, slide one, and drop one. <laughs> Hope that came out okay. Yep, it did. Alright, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna give this another uh, 15 minutes or so, and then I'm going to rotate the chickens so that the inside part gets heat as well. This is actually the best way to do it because if you take off the top grate, just don't even use the grate, put it on the charcoal grate and use the side baskets to heat up the chicken, it works out perfectly. I've done it many times before in the past. All right, another 15 minutes. Time to check the chicken again. And that's what it's looking like at this point. I think that is, this really is the only way to do it, is you got to have two gloves. One so that you can lift it out of the rack and turn it. Time for another turning. Let me get the gloves on here. Yeah, it's looking good. Let's move it over. Yeah, it's looking pretty good. Another 15 minutes. Time for another flipping of the chicken. Yeah, it's looking pretty good. We'll do it one last time. I think this will be the final time. 
yeah, it's very easy. You don't do anything. You just have to move the racks. And the final review. Yeah, I would say it looks pretty good. Okay. Problem is, is this thing is uh, a little bit bigger than this pan, so I gotta hold, hold it a little differently. There we go. Okay, now it's time to try out the chicken. <laughs> so I have a couple pieces here. Let's try one here. It actually, looks pretty good, I think. Um, the rub that I'm using is uh, Kickin' Chicken from Weber. It's easy to do this. Uh, all you do is sprinkle it on and you're done. <laughs> Let's give it a try. Mmm. Overall, I would say pretty good. Anyways, if you liked the video, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and I'll talk to you guys next time.